come to baseball clinics where there's frost on the field. Woohoo! Uh, Major League Baseball Players Assist Alumni Association hosting today's clinic. We have an outfielder. Uh, he's a 1967 draft pick by the Detroit Tigers. He played with them during the 1972 season. Ike Blessing. Next, we have a right-handed pitcher. He made his major league debut with the Pittsburgh Pirates in 1970. Uh, Dick Colson. Instructor. He's an outfielder, first baseman, and DH from 1969 <laughs> to 1989. Primarily with the Braves, Giants, and the Detroit Tigers. Hit 414 lifetime home runs while driving in 1,354 RBI. Twice led the league in walks and retired at eighth place all time on the walks list in 1605. Led the league in 1985 with 40 home runs. Was, first in the, was the first player to hit 40 home runs in each league. 1973 team of the same year, David Johnson has won the record of three Braves. 100 with three teams. <laughs> he played two league, two league championships and one World Series, collecting the championship ring with your Detroit Tigers in 1984. Darrell Evans. Yeah, Darrell. Way to go. The third baseman wasn't an outfielder. Exactly. He didn't play third <laughs> outfield at all. Oh, no, he puts a good hand. Made his major league debut in 1982 with the Baltimore Orioles. Finished with a career uh, fielding percentage of 978. Glenn Golder. Yeah. You're on. 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 You're 1969, three of his 28 home runs were grand slams. Uh, 1968 World Series, he batted 304 with a home run, three RBIs. He was an all-star in his first full season, batting 273 with 29 home runs and 104 RBIs. Willie Horton. Yeah, uh, hey. Next, we have a left-handed pitcher. Uh, 1963 to 76, and then 78 and 79, primarily with the Detroit Tigers. Standout in 1968 World Championship team, he collected 17 wins, including including compiling a 10 and 2 record in the final two months of the season. Won three games in the World Series and hit a home run. And was uh, hit a home run. Was named the Series MVP. A career 3.44 ERA. Struck out 200 batters seven times and won at least 14 games in each of his years as a Tiger. Finished his career as 12th all-time in strikeouts. In 1971, he led the league with 25 wins, 308 strikeouts. Uh, that might followed yeah. by 22 wins with the 202.5 ERA. Mickey Lloyd. Yeah, Mickey. Yeah. Next instructor. Many of you know him. He's a longtime coach with the Tigers, an AD with the University of Michigan. Uh, he currently still serves as a coach and as a special assistant as well. Don Lund. Played nine years with the Oakland A's from 1977 to 1985. In 1981, he won 14 games through four shutouts, both top marks in the American League. Uh, he finished second in AL Cy Young voting behind only, only behind Hall of Famer Raleigh Finger. The 2.33 ERA, he appeared in the AL Division Series where he threw a complete game against the Royals, giving up just one run and earning the win. Three numbers include 63 wins and a 3.99 ERA. Steve McCaddy. and third baseman, uh, Detroit native who played with the New York Mets during the 1963 and 64 seasons, Al Moran. Next instructor, right-handed pitcher, 
right-handed pitcher, drafted in 1983 by the Cleveland Indians, Cleveland Indians out of Manhattan College in the Bronx. 1984 Midwest League All-Star while playing with Waterloo. A 1986 Eastern League All-Star, so Waterbury Indians. And 1986 Eastern League Pitching Prospect of the Year, Mike Murphy. The third round draft pick by the Saint, by St. Louis Cardinals in uh, 76. Uh, played with them during the 78 and 79 seasons, Dan O'Brien. <laughs> Next instructor, he's a middle infielder, drafted by the Washington Senators in 1965. Played with the Senators during the 71 and 72 seasons when they relocated from D.C. to Texas and became the Rangers. And it was a uh, Cleveland Indian in 1973, Tom Ragland. Not least, just because Alphabet made him at the end. <laughs> right handed pitcher, 1969 to 1971 with the Tigers and Twins. Carried a 3.63 career ERA with the 10 and 5 record. It was 9 and 4 with the 3.22 ERA while helping the Twins with their second straight division title in 1970. Bill Zeph. <laughs>